Hello everyone, uh, welcome back. Uh, yeah, so I have a kind of a hodgepodge of things here. And I got some candles, I got a couple of wax melts, um, just a little hodgepodge of things here. And also uh, at the Chinese uh, grocery store, it's about 10 minute drive from us, they had this little beauty section and usually the shelves are kind of bare. But now that I'm more into like Korean and Japanese skincare and that, um, I went uh, just after work today and they had the shelves loaded and I was like, oh, the heavens have opened and shining down upon me because I am so excited about all this Japanese uh, and Korean skincare and to have it just at a local um, grocery center is very exciting. Did you got my slipper, Abby? Oh, oh well. Anyway, okay, so I'm going to start first. Um, so I popped into Walmart to get some boring stuff. And on Ramona's channel, uh, Ramona does not like amber scents. Uh, so I love amber scents. They uh, be still my beating heart. Oh, I love amber scents. Uh, but she liked this one. And this one is from Glade. And uh, she had a review on her channel and she was actually pretty impressed with this. Uh, I haven't bought a Glade candle in years. They just tunneled on me and didn't have any throw. But that was a few years ago, so uh, maybe they've improved. So this one is called Sultry Amber, sorry, Sultry Amber Rhythms. And this one, the notes are black rum, leather, and mint. So right up my alley, I tell you. I think this was uh, $3.99 Canadian can't quite remember. Uh, I think it's three and a half ounces. I think, I think. Oh, I don't see it on here, but I think it's like three and a half ounces. So um, just the, the one wick. They did have a larger one, uh, probably at least double the size. Um, but I thought I'd start with this little gaffer. And I do get I do get an amber scent with some uh, kind of a soft leather suede kind of vibe. I don't get mint though. Maybe when it's melting, um, some of that mint comes out. But I just get a really sexy kind of leathery amber. Really, really nice. So, anyway, thank you, Ramona, for that suggestion. Um, I will definitely give that one a try. And then. Um, also in uh, Walmart, okay, Walmart Canada, we're ready, up here, we're, we're ready for some new scents, okay? Just just letting you know we're ready for some new scents, so anytime now. But anyway, I did get another Girlfriend Night. Uh, this is a perfumey, uh, kind of berry sangria kind of scent. Uh, if this was a perfume, I would wear it, um, but I'm not going to melt this and pour it over my body. Uh, I don't like it that much. Oh, I really, it's, oh, it's a, it's a nice, very nice scent. And we're going to put this. Now, the one that looked new, I, I don't remember seeing this before. Um, maybe it is and just popped up in our store. But anyway, it's Guava Peach. The label's so pretty. Yeah, it's just your basic tropical, sweet, fruity scent. So, yeah, um... I, I don't remember seeing that one before. And then I went to, uh, where was I? Winners or Winners? Um, I didn't have time to ha hit the other stores like Home Sense and that, but um, I did go into Winners and I did find a couple candles there. Oh, I did find this shirt. Um, I don't know, I guess I was in kind of a romantic mood, but it looks so whimsical and pretty. So I got this shirt, this white shirt. Whoop, let's flip that over. Oh, I got it backwards. Sorry, you don't want to see the back. There's the front, and I just really love that kind of uh, detail. And then had these little polka dots on the rest. It was just nice and flowy, and that just so pretty. Uh, I won't, I'll probably just wear that outside the house because the dogs are going to just get it dirty pretty quick. But anyway, okay, so candle-wise, uh, yeah, so DW, uh, I cannot find very many three wicks lately or two wicks. I think 14 ounce two wicks. 
And uh, yeah, I don't know. They're they're coming out with all these smaller ones, and I prefer the the larger ones, the two wick, three wick. So anyway, I don't know. They they do have a fair number of scents, but it's just all these smaller ones. But I did get uh, wild honey nectar, and it's uh, this little two wick jar. How many ounces here? Four point six. 6.5 ounces. They're very accurate. 4.65 ounces. Uh, so yeah, uh, I just, this is a very strong scent. Uh, hopefully it's strong in this size. But yeah, this will knock your sinuses right out of your noggin there. Um, just, oh, very, like really, really rich. Uh, I do have, I think I have a two wick somewhere in storage there somewhere. But uh, yeah, I just, I love that scent and it's strong. And uh, another DW that I got was this 9.1 ounce, and it is just the one wick, and it's in cucumber water. Oh, I can smell it as soon as I take the lid off. Oh, I love cucumber scents. They're so light and refreshing. They're so, I just love them for the summertime. And this is pretty authentic. Um, prefer a two wick. I think they burn a little better than a one wick, but they didn't have any, and I just love this scent. So, um... Glad to find that one. And then, um, oh, and Walmart, too. Uh, just getting on this little nail polish kick. Um, they had this, uh, the Sally Hansen Insta Dry Nail Polish, because I have no patience. I'm not waiting an hour for my nail polish to dry. And this one is called Buttered Popcorn. And it's this cream color. And now, at first, I thought those were gold flecks. But I think they're just, I don't know, I think they're clear flex, but really shiny. But that one's buttered popcorn. And then um, these sinful color ones, I really do like them. They're like $1.99. And uh, as long as I put a top coat on, they last fairly long. And I love the color yellow. So this one is YOLO yellow. And... This one's really pretty. This is their Naughty Nudes line, and this is in Tees. So this is one, when I was in the store, had a little better lighting. And there's like about three colors in here. There's like a peachy pink, there's a taupe, uh, even a little bit of blue comes through. It's really, it's really kind of a neat color. And then this one is called Rorange. I don't know if that's like a mix of red and orange. Um, but yeah, it's beautiful in the fall. It's just that really deep, deep, rusty kind of color. So, anywho. All right, so, uh, oh, one uh, another thing. I almost forgot. This is, this is big. This is, I found this in Marshalls, actually, and I was quite shocked to see it. It's the Violet Voss. Hashtag uh, Holy Grail eyeshadow palette. And yeah, I was very surprised to see it. There's about half the price that it is in Sephora. And uh, those are the colors there. Just those rich, deep, warm colors. And I bought some matcha tea. Now, I bought this previously, and I really liked it. It's the Organic Strawberry Matcha Tea. And this one's really good because it's nice strawberry flavor to it. Because uh, matcha tea is very... Oh, it kind of tastes like grass, basically. Uh, but this one's kind of strawberry flavored. But matcha is supposed to have like a thousand times more antioxidants than green tea. It has all these benefits and everything like that. So I've actually been really enjoying this. They do have a variety pack where you get different flavors. Uh, but I really did like the strawberry one. And you get 20 little tubes for uh, $4.99. And yeah, that's what the, the packaging looks like. So yeah, I'm uh, trying to eat healthier and all that stuff. And then this is the Cargo Big Bronzer. Um, this was $9.99. And this one's beautiful. That's the packaging. Very nice. And I'm not into orange bronzer because it just doesn't do anything for me. I, I kind of need like a reddish kind of tone to it. So this one looked somewhat cool toned in the store. In this lighting it's going to look a little more orange but um, in the store it looked a little better but 
um, yeah, it's a pretty design. It's, oh, it's so soft. And there's a little, I think there's a little bit of a sheen to it. And it's probably not going, oh yeah, it's probably not going to pick up too much there. And yeah, it might look a little bit orange in this light. Um, but yeah, it seemed to be a good color for me anyhow. And I don't know what your favorite top coat is for nail polish. Um, I've tried so many and I my nail polish never survives more than a few days. But I did tr I'm did. i going to try the OPI Rapid Dry. Again, it has to dry fast. Um, so I'm going to try this quick dry top coat from OPI. So uh, if you know a really good top coat that's not overly expensive, maybe one that you can find in the discount stores, let me know. Okay, I'm going to finish up with the stuff at the Chinese grocery store. I love going there. They have stuff from Poland and Europe and just, and I just love trying out new stuff. So I did, because of my not, matcha, matcha tea kick, I did get a package of matcha tea. And then I do really like milk tea in these bottles that they have there. Um, I just like taking them at work. I just drink them cold. And yeah, I just I just really like the taste of them. And then, uh, now at the Real Canadian Superstore, you can actually buy these. If you're Canadian, these, um, these masks. Uh, so what you do is you take out a mask and you open it up and it heats up to 40 degrees Celsius. These have done wonders for my tension headaches. Like, I, I just, these are a lifesaver for me. Um, so yeah, they're one-time use, uh, but I can find them at the Real Canadian Superstore, and I just found them at the Chinese grocery store. These ones are a pack of five, but at the store, uh, the Chinese one, they have a pack of 12. And yeah, they are just a godsend for my headaches. And then, now the, this I found at the Real Canadian Superstore, it's RYO. And it's a Japanese company, and this is a very, very popular shampoo and conditioner. They have different lines. This one is um, Damage Care, and this is it's dripping wet because it came out of the shower. This is a, a nourishing treatment. Holy moly. Uh, my, my bottle is peeing all over me here. Anyway, I just tried it once. I was happy with the results. I, I mean, once isn't going to give me a good idea, but I did like it. Um, and yeah, they, they buy it, sell it at the other store also. And then I found this one also. This is by the same company, RYO. And I love the packaging. So cute. Anyway, this is the Scalp Deep Cleansing uh, Shampoo. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm, I like buying those uh, shampoos that really focus on your scalp because they say if you've got a healthy scalp you got healthy hair and um, this might just get rid of some of the buildup also but um, I thought I'd give it a try anyhow and they have a lot of uh, oh I got some chopsticks because ours keep disappearing I bought some more chopsticks but I bought this little ceramic mug and I when I go outside in the summer bugs always end up end up in my drink um, they like the sweetness of it, but anyway, this one has a lid, and actually, you can do your makeup with this lid. It's like a little mirror. So yeah, I just thought I'd put a drink in there and uh, keep the bugs out, and um, oop, if it gets on there. But yeah, I thought it was really cute. Got a lot of different designs in that. And oh, that one got pushed over. Oh, they had the Lulu Lun. Uh, face masks. Now, I can find these in mini so, but I did find them in the Chinese grocery store. $7.99 and you get seven masks. This is probably the number one mask I think in Japan. So they had four different formulas. Uh, they had it, this is a, a seven pack, so they're all together. They had the bigger packs also. I can't remember how many masks were in there. But this one is the moisturizing one, I believe. And they had these Next Care. Now I can only find these online at Yes Style or something like that. But I found them in the, the grocery store. And it's one of those uh, little pimple patches. So you put it on a pimple and it's um, supposed to reduce the redness and make it a little bit smaller by morning. And I, I do actually find they do work. And uh, this is by Softimo. 
Um, now, I think most of their, their products were Japanese rather than uh, Korean, actually. This is the Softy Mo uh, washing foam with hyaluronic acid. I think this was only $5.99 or something like that. Um, or maybe it was a bit more. The Softy Mo cleansing oil is one of the best cleansing oils I've ever tried, and I've tried a lot of cleansing oils. It is excellent. Um, uh, so I thought I'd try this uh, cleansing foam. And they had Hada Lebeau products. I couldn't believe it. The only place I can get Hada Lebeau in Canada is online from Choosy, um, which is a Vancouver site. And that's the only place I can I can get it, or Yes Style, but I'd rather order from Canada. Uh, but yeah, they carried some products. Now they're more expensive in the Chinese grocery store. Um, so I still order them online, but there was a couple things that were a little bit about the same price. So I did get this Hada Lebeau um, cream. I love their toner. Their toner is the most moisturizing toner in the world. I put this toner on and I don't even have to put moisturizer or serums or anything on. It's so moisturizing. So I want to try the, the cream out. So man, to see Hada Lebeau in a store in London, Ontario. It's like, yes! And then uh, I've heard a lot about this Nature Republic aloe vera. It's 92% aloe vera. And I've seen some videos where people have like 10 uses for this. They use it in their hair. They use it as a face mask. They use it on burns. They, just a whole different a range of things they can do with good old aloe vera. So I've heard good things about this particular one. I think this was like $7.99 and you get a lot. There is a lot in here. So what else did I get? Um... I think, I think that's it guys. So yeah, just a little bit of everything. Um, so yeah, if you're looking for some Korean or Japanese products, check out your local um, Asian stores. You never know. They, I, I would love to go to Toronto the next time we go and check out Koreatown or Chinatown or something like that. Um, yeah, I'd be bringing quite a few bags of items home, I think. Um, so anyway, I hope you enjoyed, and um, everyone take care. I'm going to go watch the Toronto Raptors, hopefully win, and um, we'll see you soon. Bye.